guys, so today I'm going to be doing a basic backdrop design, but I'm going to be using the LED uh, lights for your backdrop. It's a string of lights and it really can give your backdrops an extra pop, right? And just give it a nice little uh, luminous look, right? So this is actually unboxing. This, uh, these actually just came in. And this is a video that's in partnership with CV Linens. And this is pretty much what they look like when you take them out of the box. And again, this is how the box look. The, the link will be actually in the product description where you can get yours from uh, CV Linens yourself. And so these are actually 10 feet wide by 10 foot long. So what you're going to do is just kind of get them all untangled first, right? And as you see, it have the little sandwich ties on them, so it kind of keeps them really neat, so you don't have to worry about doing a whole lot of untangling. So I just would untangle the very the main one that handles the entire strand, just like that, to get it all sorted out. Now for the sake of today's video, I am going to double up on my lights. Um, because my backdrop is only six foot wide. So I'm actually gonna double up on the lights and do a double strand so I can get a lot of light onto this backdrop. So, that's the entire strand. So what I'm going to do is first attach these to my backdrop, right? And I'm gonna attach them to the backdrop using uh, my favorite <laughs> pipe cleaners, right? Now, normally I would be doing this from, from the back of the backdrop, right? But for the sake of today's video, I'm going to be doing it from the front. Now what you're going to be doing now is taking a pipe cleaner just like this, and you're going to be securing it around your crossbar, just like that. So you're going to go around the crossbar and just give it a twist or two because this is what you're actually going to be using to hang up your lights. Now you want to use one in between each of the panels. So you're going to use one in between each of the six panels as well as one on each end, right? So you just go find where your next tube meet and secure your pipe cleaner. Just like that. Give it a tie or two and then you're good to go. Get yourself another pipe cleaner and continue to go and do it with the remaining of your panels. Just like that. Now you're going to attach your LED lights or LED lights to your backdrop. So you want to make sure you have them in the back, but I'm going to be attaching them to the front so you guys can see. So I'm going to go to that first uh, pipe cleaner and I am just going to secure these by just giving it a good little twist making it tight, but not too tight. So it's there, just like that. Then I am going to take the strand, cross over to my next pipe cleaner, and do the same exact thing. So I just wanna put it in there, and give my pipe cleaners a good little twist just to secure it, just like that. So you have a strand hanging, and you have a strand hanging. Same thing, you're gonna go reach around the back. And again, attach them to your pipe cleaner, give it a little twist, and that's hanging. And you're going to do the same exact thing on the entire backdrop. Now, 
once you get all the way to the entire end, like I mentioned before, I am going to double strand this because it is, um, the backdrop is only six feet wide. So all I'm gonna do is go back in the opposite direction, do the same exact thing. You wanna secure it to the backdrop. Now, once you get to, to the end, which will be your last strand, you just let it hang, right? So now what you're gonna do is you're gonna go in, since these are brand new, you're gonna undo the sandwich ties for each strand and kinda of just let it hang. And you're gonna do that for each one. Right, kind of just let it hang. You want to be careful not to get them uh, like tangled up. But these are pretty, these are pretty decent. They don't have a bunch of, uh, you know, the, the, the wire is like pretty easy to maintain. It's not like real prone to get tangled. It's like a soft, flexible plastic. It's not like those, um, what are they called? They drive me nuts. The beads and the, uh, the, the bling strands. So you just wanna go in and do each and every strand just like that. You just wanna untangle it, right? But maybe no taller than eight feet. And then she's going to complete her design by polishing it up and um, puddling, puddling the bottom. Okay, so at this point, I was not quite sure that my microphone had died. So that is on the lights because they do um, have several settings where you can range the speed, you can range, you can um, alternate, you know, the pattern. It's like many settings, maybe about seven. Um, so check that out. Again, I have no clue what I was talking about because I didn't remember, but I do know that the when you're plugging the lights up, you definitely want to be sure that you have, um, you know, a, a extension cord that's either white or something like that because the cord does not go all the way to the bottom. So you definitely don't want something like a heavy duty um, cord or anything like that showing. So here is the setting going really fast. And don't forget, I do have my lights doubled up so you will see like a lot of light as opposed to if I had it extended the entire 10 feet. Now we're going to cut off some more light so you can see how it is completely dark. Now I'm just going to give you guys even more light while I'm changing the setting so you can see how illuminated it really is when you have it on a higher setting. And again, this is and this is completely dark. Now this is if you just have it on a really slow, like a, a gradient um, 
ombre effect. Now, I think just for the sake of the camera, it kind of make it look like there are like waves going up, but it did not look like that in person. So again, just changing the different settings. And there you have it folks so they are the LED um, curtains and like I said it was very easy to assemble uh, again it was very e it didn't tangle it wasn't a lot of tangling so that wasn't a problem for me and I um, once I took these down I pretty much wrapped them up the same exact way they were when I took them out the box hope you like this video if you'd like to see more don't forget to subscribe and as of now we have two weekly videos uploading every week on Tuesdays and Thursdays so be sure to hit that uh, subscribe button so you can get the notification see you guys soon